Hey guys and welcome to this video. In this video we want to find the value of this fraction. 9 divided by 6 divided by 3 over 3 divided by 6 divided by 9. Are you ready to solve? Let's go ahead and get started. This fraction can be written as parentheses 9 divided by 6 divided by 3 and divided by parentheses 3 divided by 6 divided by 9. The numerator divided by the denominator. Now, according to the K, uh, order of operations, which is PEMDAS, PEMDAS, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponents, M and D stands for multiplication and division, and A and S stands for addition and subtraction. We first do parentheses, then exponents, then multiplication and division, and finally addition and subtraction. Remember that multiplication and division have equal priority and we have to work from left to right. And the same applies to addition and subtraction. Now, here, uh, according to the PEMDAS, uh, first we have to handle these parentheses. And inside these parentheses, we have uh, division. Okay, so first this division, 9 divided by 6. Okay, parentheses, 9 divided by 6 can be written as 9 over 6 and divided by 3 divided by this parentheses 3 divided by 6 and divided by 9 okay 9 divided by 6 um, can be simplified 9 divided by 3 gives us 3 and 6 divided by 3 equals 2 so 3 over 2 divided by 3 3 over 2 divided by 3 divided by 3 divided by 6 divided by 9. Now, 3 over 2 divided by 3 according to the KCF rule. K stands for keep, C stands for change, and F stands for flip. Keep the first fraction, change division to multiplication, and flip the, the second fraction. Or second fraction is 3 over 1 okay according to this uh, rule this parenthesis can be written as uh, 3 over 2 and times 1 over 3 okay divided by 3 divided by 6 divided by 9 now this 3 and this 3 can cancel each other out and we have 1 divided by 2. So this parenthesis uh, equals 1 divided by 2 and divided by this parenthesis. 3 divided by 6 divided by 9. Now we have to handle this parenthesis. Inside this parenthesis we have 3 divided by 6 and divided by 9. First 3 divided by 6. 3 divided by 6 uh, equals 3 over 6. Okay, so 1 over 2 divided by 3 over 6 and divided by 9. Now, uh, 3 divided by 3 over 6 divided by 9 according to the KCF rule can be written as okay. 3 over 6 and times 1 over 9. Okay. And here, uh, 3 divided by 3 equals 1 and 9 divided by 3 equals 3. This uh, parenthesis equals 1 over 6 times 3, which equals 1 over 18 okay so we have 1 over 2 divided by 1 over 18 and uh, again uh, according to the kcf rule we can write 1 over 2 and times just 18 and this is equal to uh, 18 divided by 2 which equals just 9. So our final answer to this problem is just 9.
2 cubed minus 2 cubed then times these parentheses and inside these parentheses we have 3 plus 2 are you ready to solve let's get started 2 cubed gives us 8 so we have here 8 minus again here we have 8 then times 3 plus 2 equals 5 8 minus 8 equals 0 and 0 times 5 is just 0 but this answer is not correct because according to the order of operations which is PEMDAS P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponents, M and D stands for multiplication and division and A and S stands for addition and subtraction we first do parentheses then exponents then multiplication and division and finally addition and subtraction remember that multiplication and division uh, have high uh, have equal priority and we work from left to right and the same goes for addition and subtraction so here uh, we first do these parentheses 3 plus 2 gives us 5 so our expression equals 2 cubed minus 2 cubed then times just 5 now uh, in this expression we have two exponents one subtraction and one multiplication according to PEMDAS first we have to handle exponents first this exponent 2 cubed gives us 8 so 8 minus 2 cubed then times 5 again 2 cubed gives us 8 so 8 minus 8 then times 5 no uh, we have one subtraction and one multiplication remember that multiplication have has higher priority than subtraction so first we have to handle this multiplication 8 times 5 gives us 40 so 8 minus 40 which equals negative 32 so our final answer to this problem is negative 32